Altamont, Altamont, my God, worst day of my life in a lot of ways. Horrible day. Uh, I don't even know if I want to talk about it. I've written about it a lot. I've talked about it a lot. Um, but it was not, you know, Altamont was not the end of the 60s for me. The end of the 60s for me, the day I said to myself, the moment I said to myself, well, this time is done, was a month or so before when the Rolling Stones played a regular concert in Oakland. And I looked at Mick Jagger, and I saw lines in his face, and I saw this ludicrous devil costume he was wearing. And though I was swept away by the music, I said, something's gone here, something's changed, things are, have gotten more serious, things have gotten more threatening, it's not going to be fun anymore. Now the Rolling Stones album, Let It Bleed, hadn't even been released when they played that concert. Today, no, no band would ever go out on tour without having the new album in the stores first. In those days, you went out and toured. If you could get the album out while you were on tour, you'd consider yourself lucky. So the Rolling Stones were doing songs from their new album that no one had heard yet, also something nobody does anymore. You've got to have the audience all primed today, but they didn't at that time. But when that album came out, Let It Bleed, it had two songs on it, the first song and the last song, that were about the end of this period that we'd all gone through, the period that had produced the Rolling Stones and produced their audience. One was called Gimme Shelter, the most terrifying rock and roll song anyone had ever recorded, and no one's matched it ever. Gimme Shelter, the world's ending. There's only terror. Let me hide. The other song which ended the album was You Can't Always Get What You Want. The chorus line being, but sometimes you might find you get what you need. Well, if there's ever been an anti-60s ethos, you can't always get what you want, but you get what you need is it. Because the 60s were about getting what you want, demanding what you wanted, finding out what it was you wanted. The idea of need was foreign. The idea of, of privation in a period of tremendous abundance was foreign. It was all there. You could take it. There was enough. That's how, how people looked at things. That's how black people looked at things. They didn't have enough, but they knew it was out there. That's how white people looked at things. They had enough. They were looking for something else. Um, well, the 60s was very much a time of gimme, but shelter was not the thing you were saying gimme for. The 60s ended on that album, as far as I'm concerned. It was a good end. It was intelligent. It was thoughtful. And more than that, those two songs, Gimme Shelter and You Can't Always Get What You Want, were great music. They made the, the, the idea that this time was over and another time was coming, it was going to be different, sound very appealing. Time to move on. It was time to move on.